Hey everybody, here we go. I'm going to show you my candy cupboard. Uh, this is for Renee, who is uh, Sisters Forever ABNR. She's been wanting to see my candy cupboard, so here you go. Uh, basically, it's on the top of the microwave over here. It's on this cupboard up here, so I gotta take a chair because I'm short. I'm gonna climb up here. Here we go. Um, basically, when I'm doing recipes for cup, uh, cupcake decorating, I should say, you need a lot of candies for that, and I always keep a lot of them on hand. So here we are. Here is the candy cupboard. Let me show you around a bit. Okay, so I, I buy a little bit of everything, so I always have some on, you know, on hand. And um, I buy them at the bulk food store, so I end up putting in these little containers. So I've got lots of different colored sugars. Uh, fruit roll-ups because those are really um, useful to make leaves and all sorts of things with that. Colored sprinkles. I've got uh, mini, mini gumdrops. Fruit slices. Um, back there, these are uh, wafer cookies that are good to make all sorts of things with. Giant gumdrops, miniature gumdrops. I've got some Tootsie Rolls down the bottom here, more colored sugar, um, miniature M&Ms, Canadian Smarties, Graham Wafer Bear Sour Belts, more sugar, more sprinkles, more colored sugar, these are little Christmassy ones, I've got some even some Christmas candy corn there. More Christmas stuff, uh, chocolate covered sunflower seeds, peanut M&M's, miniature chocolate candy thingies, more sugar, jelly beans. These are Starburst candies and uh, Tootsie Rolls. And you can make, you flatten those out, you can make almost anything with those. More gumdrops, sour cherries, little fish. And those are Rent candies, you can do all sorts of things with these. More colored sugar, and this is my sprinkle collection, and these are all my extracts, like peppermint, and coconut, and lemon, and orange, and almond. And all the sprinkles are in the corner here. Christmas, and chocolate up here, and these are snowflakes. And, you know, just all the sprinkles. And I, I even bought some of these. I've never opened the package yet, though. You can get the package open. They're called Mega Candy Buttons, and they come in different colors. So these would be good to decorate with as well. Bought these in Atlanta last year. And up top, I've got miscellaneous stuff. I've got, like, my pie cutter, pie crust cutters. I have, oh these are neat, they have giant M&Ms now. I bought a package of these giant, no sorry, giant Smarties I should say, not giant M&Ms. They're really big, so I thought those would come in handy. I have some of these Marshmallow Circus Peanuts which are moldable and can be used for a variety of things. And these are mints which I can use as eyes. That's what I bought them for. I got big ones. Like these would have been perfect for my um, Cookie Monster. And I'm thinking about doing a Kermit the Frog uh, cupcake, so I thought those would make good Kermit eyes as well. Up here we have decorating, uh, mostly cooking and baking supplies like the cupcake molds. And these are S-shaped cookies which I'm going to use to make um, that was something like um, a squirrel tail. Can you see the squirrel tail there? Up like that? Or a skunk tail? I saw one in Hello Cupcake. They did a really cute squirrel, so I bought these S cookies for that purpose. And way up there, those are all decorating icings, and my keep my paste food coloring in that can. These are tips and cookie press discs. And my cookie press is right there, that brown and beige thing. And these are decorating tips. And I have more, there's my sucker sticks 
for the cake pops. And whoa! Oh no, things are falling. And there's my silicone baking cups. So there you go, the candy cupboard. Bye-bye.